Hey babies, welcome back to my channel. It's your favorite girl, Miss Erin Yvette, and we're back in my closet. I am so excited to be back. It's a new season. There's no need for a long introduction, y'all. I have honestly just been anticipating this season for a while so I can come out with my fashion videos. This sponsor is a new one brought to you by Blushmark Official. You guys can check out all their information, as always, in the description box below. I also have a coupon code for my babies. But nonetheless, today, me and you, sis, we're going to be trying out these pieces together to see what Blushmark is really all about. I'm going to be telling you about the quality, the fit, as well as the price. Without a further ado, let's just hop right into it if you are not already a member of the fam sis what you waiting for go ahead tap that subscribe button it's free and who doesn't like free things i mean come on okay let's see what we got let's see what we got one thing that i noticed about the site let's go into a little background so blush mark reached out to your girl to try a few pieces real quick just to show you guys what their site is really about and my first hand experience on the site i noticed they had some really affordable pieces y'all know we love to say coins over here so i was really intrigued by that all right went on the site they had some really affordable pieces i want to say like literally three four dollar tops five dollar skirts things like that but one of the main things that stood out to me was their authenticness okay they had a lot of original pieces a lot of fashionable instagram baddie pieces as well but what really caught my eye was sophisticated look that they had as well i mean how do you get sophisticated pieces on a budget that that is a challenge right here on this channel if you guys know you know we love a good challenge right so today's pieces that i picked out are all centered around i want to say coming of age pieces like i'm going to work i got an internship more importantly maybe i have a date or i just want to look super sophisticated in my coming of age-ness the first piece i want to show you guys is just this top right here she's black and she is i want to say like a faux satin I actually have satin sheets so she's not as silky as my sheets but i like that it doesn't look like I just rolled out of bed. It looks really polished, really clean, and really nice. I already got a compliment on this top, and I haven't even worn it yet. So just looking at this shirt, I, it really makes me feel like I got a good steal off of this because I want to say this top was less than at least 15 bucks, which for a blouse like this, this gives me blouseness, okay? For a blouse like this, you can't really beat that with a stick. I did get this in a size, I want to say small, and I really love that blush mark, their packaging, their design really comes through 100% gives you all the details you need the style this is the midnight mood top in the color black and again this is a size small I want to show you this top off the hanger it just looks like this really gorgeous I would definitely wear this something like I have on with some jeans or maybe even a skirt I don't know super cute I would also uh, dress this up and down either to work or on a date I don't know about you but I definitely would and I love that about these pieces really like the next piece that i want to show you guys is just the top that i'm wearing right here um as i said it is just an off the shoulder top i love that it's super comfortable i'm actually not wearing a bra with it right now and i feel like i don't have to in my opinion i thought this top was going to be a little bit see-through but it's really not it's just a black top you can see off the shoulder and i love that one sleeve is kind of long sleeve i do have long limbs so it doesn't necessarily like yeah it doesn't come all the way you know down the nips of my arm because i have long arms however it is long sleeved and i really like that because it is cool outside but i did i'm a florida girl so we can kind of get away with something like this or i would just say throw on a jacket or like a biker jacket or something like that super cute i thought this was fall appropriate and it was just a little bit more of a sophisticated version of crop tops that i already own so i really did want to try this so here's the back here i think this is just super cute So cute. The next piece that I got, I'm actually wearing today. I have like my bottoms on. I'm just wearing this gray crop top. It is, I want to say, a nice breathable material. It kind of reminds me of the dry fit type material. Um, I don't know if you guys can see that. Super thin, but I like that because when I'm layering, and this is what I would consider a layering piece, when I'm wearing stuff like this, I don't want them to be too thick because I'm putting other things on top of them, obviously. So I think it'll still be perfect for the fall and autumn season. If you guys are in more cooler areas where it tends to snow, I don't really know if this would be your friend, but for down here in Florida, this is like perfect for fall, autumn. And I feel like most of my friends would go out with no jacket. It would still keep you warm. However, people like me, 
I'm wearing a nice biker jacket over it. I'm gonna be so warm. And you can always add a scarf as well. Layer it up, sis. Layers. I would definitely order this in a black and a white just because, like I said, you can pair this so many different ways with skirts, any type of bottom. I also have some black, like, spandex overalls. These will look really cute with that as well. I might have to try that on for y'all. Like, you can wear this so many ways. I think this is so cute. Shout out to Blushmark because <laughs> you helped me complete my outfit today. Yes. Two outfits, pretty much. Well, the next piece that I got is actually this skirt right here. And I just remembered I have one more piece. I'm gonna have to pull out the dryer, but yes. So anyway, this is a sophisticated piece that I wanted to wear to work. And I'm so sad that I got it and it doesn't actually fit me. I have a really, really tiny waist. I'm just tiny and all together. So if you are a more petite girl like I am, I'm glad that I'm able to try this on for you so you can see how they're gonna fit. If this does come in an extra small, I would suggest getting it. This isn't a size small that I got. And it is just this black um, and white skirt. It's a houndstooth. I was trying to see what this print or pattern is called, but houndstooth pattern. It just looks like this, so super cute. And then it has the brown buttons. I don't know if you guys can see. It has some brown um, buttons going down the skirt right there, but it also has some slits on the back as well. Anyway, everything about this skirt was really cute. There are a few things that I don't like about it besides the obvious. It's so freaking gorgeous. I love the pattern. Everything looks great. The buttons are not about to fall off or anything, and the length was actually really great. The only thing that didn't work for me was that the skirt has no fitting, which for someone who's tiny and petite like I am, these are pieces that you would want to wear like an undergarment with because it will just help fill it out and just help uh, pieces adjust to your body like perfectly. If you haven't tried undergarments, definitely try it. This is like the epitome of what those pieces are for. But I feel like if it had more of a slender waist or if it had more of a fitting going on than just like fabric, it would go perfect for me. Um, in addition to it being way too big, it just it just won't work and I'm kind of sad about that. And then I will also have to include a picture of this. This is another piece that is actually slightly too big for me. So if I could size down, I would. I was hoping it would be more of a grown and sexy. I might could wear it to brunch or to a museum with some nice sandals and a bag or a clutch or something like that. However, I ended up wearing this to work with a cardigan over the top. I am a size four usually in US sizing, but on this side, I'll say I'm probably a size two, extra small two, um, just because I haven't completely filled out my womanly features. Like I'm very, very slim, very slender, y'all see, y'all know. Um, and these pieces just, it, it was really a hit or miss. Things like crop tops, things like um, those blouses and things like that that are a little bit oversized were okay. But pieces that needed to be tight, I, I should have went down, if that makes any sense. Um, so a jumpsuit like this definitely sized down. The bottoms were way too big. Um, it kind of made me look like I was carrying just a little bit. I will try it on for you guys. Unfortunately, I don't have it right here to show you, but I will insert a picture as well. I love the color of this jumpsuit. The quality of these pieces were all amazing and unquestionable, like for real. They look like I shopped in some, maybe Zara even. The quality is really there. It's just the sizing was a little bit off for me. And this is one of the first times that I've actually purchased some sophisticated pieces, if I may say, some workwear online. Um, the only other site that I purchased from similar maybe would be Boohoo. Um, and you definitely want to focus on your sizing when you're going for pieces that are outside of your typical. Um, so yeah, I really don't have anything else to say about this site. Thank you guys so much at Blushmark for sponsoring this video and for sending me over some amazing pieces. Like I cannot wait to head back over to the site. So if you're interested in updating your closet as well, definitely click the description box, open it up and check out any of the links below as well as a coupon code for you guys save you some coins. I can't wait to share some more gift ideas. The season is changing, y'all. Oh, it's one of my favorite seasons of the year. <sighs> Which outfit was your favorite? Let me know in the comment section below. Y'all know how we love the chat. I'll see you guys in my next video.